Um, so apparently, too, I, I guess there's also a moth being named after our new uh, Donnie Tiny Hands Trump. Yes, um, this moth was actually found, and the scientist said, you know what, we're going to pick a politician's name, and <laughs> who better than Donald Trump, because the, apparently this moth looks, uh, like, this moth's hair looks exactly like <laughs> Trump's hairdo. <laughs> and I'm looking at it right now. The I mean, moth has a hair, hair a comb over? It yeah. does. It has a comb over. That's great. And they call this uh, moth species... Neopalpia Donald Trumpia. <laughs> Sorry if I butchered it, but that's that's what it is. Awesome. That is awesome. And you know, I, I want to meet these scientists and shake their hands because I mean, I just love them right at this moment. Uh, it's hilarious. I don't know. I wonder if they, all the other moths, hate them because they're so smug all the time. <laughs> That's the whole reason. But are, are his <laughs> wings are just... really tiny, so he has to like show up more and like puff out and be an arrogant asshole? Yeah, yeah. Uh, totally. He's one of those moths that are just like uh, he's just like you know. The problem is all the other moths around always sipping up the good nectar. Problem. It's sad all the time. It's weird because uh, they seem to hang out a lot around the Russian moths. <laughs> oh, that is great. Oh. That is gold right there. I love it. 